helicopters are the machines on the front line of nearly every major emergency. From air ambulances to mountain rescue, police patrol, firefighting to Coast Guard search and rescue. They are the choppers with the chops to save lives under almost any conditions. The best-selling single-engine helicopter in the world is the Airbus H125. Produced here in Columbus, Mississippi. There's about 4,000 of these H125s operating in 100 different countries around the world. We produce about 30 H125 aircraft each year. Building this bird on any given day is no mean feat. This aircraft has over 2,700 individual parts and pieces that go on the airframe. That doesn't count the thousands of nuts, washers, and bolts that are also required to assemble. These components are shipped in from all around the world. America, France, Germany, Japan, Hungary, and Morocco, and with some frame parts from Canada. Airbus relies on a just-in-time economy to maintain its stock of components. We don't have an excess amount of parts here. They show up when we need them so that we can install them on the aircraft. So we don't, we don't bog down the supply chain any more than, than it currently is. One such just-in-time part is the wiring that controls and communicates with all the components in the helicopter. Station one, at this stage, the aircraft really has nothing. So we're, we're going to be installing its guts at this point, which is the wire harness. The wires are approximately a mile and a half in length total. One wire looks pretty much like any other. So to identify them, a laser marker prints codes directly onto each cable. Some of these wires have come here from the other side of the world. To ensure nothing gets missed, the cables are first laid out flat on a 24-foot board, onto which the entire wiring specification has been carefully mapped. This helps us organize and lay out where everything is supposed to be, where everything goes. Without this table, this really would look like a big plate or bowl of spaghetti. This is the brain and nervous system of the helicopter, around 1.5 miles of it in each machine. Once fully laid out, next comes the intricate job of mounting the wires onto the pre-assembled airframe. The process will take six more days to complete. 